During the offseason, before his first full season with the Rangers, Billy Martin completed a trade sending Bill Matlock and Vic Harris to the Chicago Cubs for a right-handed pitcher coming off of a bad season with a 14-6 and record, Fergie Jenkins. Billy Martin said, People are laughing at this team, and they will laugh when I say we'll be a contending team next season. Let's see who's laughing then. On June 4th, 1974, Cleveland had a promotion trying to boost ticket sales, 10 cent beer night. If you went to this game, you would get up to six at a time, 12 ounce beers for 10 cents each. There was no limit to how many times you could do this. This caused a very intoxicated crowd that ended up throwing things on the field, going on the field, arrest, and game stoppage. This resulted in the game being forfeited in the ninth inning with the Rangers winning. I could go on and on on this topic. If you would like to hear more about it, let me know down below and I can maybe do a separate video just for that. The Rangers, who were still not getting the fans in the seats, were struggling financially and made some moves during the offseason for more of a financial gain. The 1974 Texas Rangers were pitcher Jim Bibby, catcher Ken Suarez, who was traded to Cleveland, outfielder Bill Sudeikis, who was sold to the Yankees, pitcher Fergie Jenkins, pitcher Jackie Brown, left fielder Alex Johnson, pitcher David Clyde, infielder Jim Fergosi, right fielder Jeff Burrows, the 1974 All-Star pitcher Bill Gugolowski, who was traded to Cleveland, outfielder Tom Grieve, pitcher Steve Fawcett, pitcher Jim Merritt, second base Dave Nilsson, manager and coaches Billy Martin, Frank Lucchese, Art Fowler, Charlie Silvera, and Jackie Moore, outfielder Elliot Maddox, sold to the Yankees before the season, pitcher Pete Broberg, third baseman Lenny Randall, catcher Dick Billings, Shortstop, Toby Hara. Pitcher, Lloyd Allen. Catcher, Bill Fahey. DH, Jim Spencer. Shortstop, Pete McKinnon. Pitcher, Rick Henninger. Shortstop, Jim Mason, who was also sold to the Yankees. Center fielder, Joy Lovato. Pitcher, Jim Schellenbach. Outfielder, Cesar Tovar. Pitcher, Larry Gura, who was traded from the Cubs in November of 73, then traded to the Yankees of May of 74, never playing as a Ranger. Outfielder, Terry Crowley, purchased in December of 73, and then sold March of 74, never playing for the Rangers. 1974 ended with the Rangers in second place in the AL West with a record of 84 and 76. This was the second time in franchise history that the club ended a season over 500. Fergie Jenkins had an amazing 25 win, 12 loss season with six shutouts and a 2.82 ERA. Now 19 year old David Clyde continued to struggle going 3 and 9 on the season with a 4.38 ERA. Mike Hargrove who started the season in single A winning the AL Rookie of the Year for the Rangers ended the season with a 3 23 batting average and Jeff Burrows American League MVP slugged a whopping 25 home runs on the season. All right, that concludes 1974. Uh, stay tuned for 1975 and as always let me know what you guys think down below. Hit that like button if you like it. Hit that not like button if you don't like it. Um, and as always, thanks for watching.